Hello everyone, welcome to the next level of the screen capture tool that we are going to build today. This video will support a GUI based screen capture tool which will have some options such as button to capture the screenshot and an option to add delay for capturing the screenshot. So let's get started. We are building a, a small J frame and which will be central line and it will not have much in terms of the visual presences. default delay will be zero we'll set an id to this label so that we can access the values in this and java string provides access to event listener so we'll add an event listener to this button we can double click it and our class is ready so we'll copy the screen capture code from this main method, we'll just call the JFrame class. We'll remove these imports from here. We don't need them here save this one and we'll add this we'll be building a method here this is this method is not going to have any argument this is asking to add exception clauses so whenever this method is called it will take a capture and save to the default directory of the project uh, what we are going to attempt is call this method when this button is clicked since the method throws some exceptions so it is asking us to surround this statement with the try catch block so if some error occurs it can be captured and thrown till now we haven't taken in consideration the delay part so let's say that we will we are interested in implementing that also so we'll take the let's say that we want to have a delay int delay equals to integer dot pass int and then we need to pass a string so here our string will be text input delay dot get text if 
delay is greater than zero we need to delay the process for certain amount of second we can also have a separate method for that for the adding delay but for now we are not going to do that we will duplicate this code i know that this is not the best practice in fact let's do that we will create a method called as public void delay and our event listener will be calling the delay method and delay will do that stuff we will have this code here and we will do this stuff here so if there is delay we will call the thread to sleep and sleep will be the delay times it is also asking to add interrupted exception and then this will call the take capture method this will also ask for the and here will not call the and let's run this program we will add a system out so that if there is any delay we can have a notice of it So our GUI is here. For now, we will not be adding any delay. And let's run this program. So a screen capture is successful. Let's check that out. And here it is. So we have successfully captured a screenshot without any delay. Let's now test it with some delay. Let's delay it for 3000 milliseconds. So it slept for a while and then it took the delay and captured the screenshot. So that's it guys. Thank you for watching our video series and if you liked our video please subscribe to our channel and like this video. Thanks.